If you're seeing our smiling faces, you know we are in our happy place at Karma Cat Zen Dog Rescue Society in Milltown. Thank you so much for watching our latest Kitty Corner video here. I'm Debbie Mazella, along with my friends and wonderful volunteers here at Karma Cat. And there is so much to talk about. If you love cats and you love wine, boy, do we have an event coming up for you on August 19th from 6 to 8. It is at Cream Ridge Winery and it is the annual Karma Cat Wine Tasting. There's gonna be a silent auction, there's gonna be prizes. You get to taste 10 wines, which is fantastic, and you get to see this lovely crew and more at Cream Ridge. So make sure you buy your tickets, you can get them. We'll have the link right here on the page, and of course you can buy them on Karma Cat's website as well. And another thing we wanna talk about is the annual event called Clear the Shelters. Now that is gonna be from August 25th through August 27th, and they are gonna be having adoption events here at the Mac Center in Milltown all of those days. So we're going to have some more information for you, but just mark the date of August 25th through 27th. It is the annual Clear the Shelters event, and it's always a wonderful event to find these deserving animals great homes. And we've got another great fundraising event to talk about. We had an interview with Joel and Marianne with Nick Grissy, who took his bike across the country to raise money for Karma Cat Zen Dog Rescue Society. He came up with a grand total and we're going to turn it over to Janine and she's going to tell you all about it. Thanks Debbie. Yes. So a special thank you to Nick Grissy and our friends at Magic. Joel and Marianne did a wonderful interview with him talking about his uh, $10,000 goal. He is cycling across the country this summer in record heat to raise $10,000 for Karma Cat and he is super close, like literally within a couple hundred dollars of his $10,000 goal. So if you want to hear his interview with The Morning Show and uh, donate to his fundraiser, again, check out the Kitty Corner So because all of that information is, is in the Magic Kitty Corner. And then one more thing I want to mention before we talk about volunteers is that you do have the opportunity to sponsor a townhouse or an apartment here at our adoption center. So it's just a monthly donation and then you'll have your name on all of our enclosures where the cats stay. So um, find out about that as well. So we'd love to have you sponsor a townhouse or an apartment here at our adoption center with your name on it. So now Lauren can talk about volunteers. Thanks, Janine. As always, we are always looking for help with different kinds of volunteers. We have opportunities for you to volunteer here at our adoption center or in the comfort of your very own home. Um, here at the Adoption Center, we're looking for help with cleaners, um, people that come in and help to feed the kitties, make sure that they are living in clean spaces, um, make sure that their little beds and blankets are all clean and spiffy for them. Um, and that happens every morning and every evening here at the Adoption Center. We're also looking for help with a lot of things that can be done from home. Uh, we're looking for help with our social media team, writing up posts for Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. Uh, we're looking for additional help with grant writing, helping us bring in the very important dollars that help to keep this whole organization running. Um, fundraising events, um, and also planning the fundraising events. We have a lot of events during the year. As Debbie mentioned, we have the wine tasting event. We have Clear the Shelters. We have our annual pause for celebration every year, and a lot of work goes into that. And if you have a passion for planning events, we would love to have you join our team. Um, we also need help when it comes to merchandise and crafting at our crafter events um, that happen throughout the year. And of course, as always, we are looking for fosters. Um, fostering is one of the biggest ways that we can help alleviate the burden that the shelters are feeling right now. Um, a lot of them are very overcrowded. We're doing our very best to take as many animals as we can out of those dangerous shelter situations. Um, and one of the biggest ways that the community can help is by opening up if you have an extra room in your home or a little bit of a space where you can set up a crate for an animal to keep it comfortable for a little while. Just being able to provide that space makes a huge difference in saving the lives of these animals. So if you're interested in fostering or volunteering in any of the other ways that I've mentioned, please feel free to click the link below and we will get you onboarded onto the team. I'm going to turn it over to Gina so she can tell you about some of the amazing kitties we have up for adoption right now. Thanks, Lauren. So our featured adoptables this month are the stunning Harlow. She's black and white. She's six years old. She likes other cats, so if you're looking for a companion for your cat at home, she'd be a great choice. 
We also have Sam Adams. Sam Adams is a white and black cow kitty. He's seven years old and he prefers to be the king of his castle. So he's looking for a home without any other cats. We have Anna, who is a gorgeous tuxedo uh, female. She is also more or less preferring to be the only cat in your house. She loves all the attention. She's a bit of a diva, but she gives hugs, and she's a very, very sweet girl. She is four years old, and we also have Kamala, who is an absolutely stunning calico. She's also four years old, and she would also prefer to be your one and only love. And she's actually here at the Adoption Center currently. So if you'd like to meet any of these cats, just follow the link from the um, Kitty Corner website, and you can find out more information about these cats and any of our other cats that are available for adoption. And I, I just really want to focus on one thing that Lauren mentioned about the shelters and the animals being in there. One of the best things about being involved with Karma Cat and these fine ladies and the guys here is that they have great relationships with the shelters. So they will go to all the different shelters. They will find the cats that have been there the longest, the ones that have been overlooked, bring them to the Mac Center to have the spotlight shown on them so that this way they could find a deserving home. So again, the fosters are a big thing. And also coming here to the Mac Center, doing a meet and greet with a cat that may spark your interest would really just be so wonderful if you could adopt through Karma Cat. Because again, they have the great relationships with the shelters and they're just trying to help out the community and find deserving homes. So don't forget about all the events we got coming up August 19th, the wine tasting at Cream Ridge and also August 25th through 27th the Clear the Shelters event. Thank you so much for your eyes on our video, for watching every month. We so appreciate you. And this is the place to come to find your new furry best friend. I'm Debbie Mazella. Thanks for watching. We will catch you next month. Six seven four four. Oh yeah. Six eight four four. We're I'm gonna already wrong. I'm gonna play, I was I'm already gonna wrong. play a box yep. six, six, seven, six seven four four. four, four. Yeah. If you want to play the lottery and win some money, play the number 6844. Take it from all of us here at Karma Cat. You will have cat hair all over you forever. Good luck and lots of extra scratch. Okay? 6844. Remember those numbers.